This video will show how design engineers using NX Design Simulation can quickly perform multiple what-if simulations of a product's performance to choose the most promising design alternatives. In this example, the designer is working on a plastic electronic housing which cannot deform by more than 0.6 millimeters. As you see here, NX Design Simulation works in the same NX CAD environment that's already familiar to designers. In addition, the interface is designed so that even occasional users of simulation are quickly productive. Here, predefined user roles are used to present designers with an uncluttered menu. The designer has the option of performing several types of analysis on this plastic housing, including linear statics, modal analysis, buckling, and thermal analysis. In this case, he selects a linear static analysis. The designer then assigns a material properties to the simulation model, but material properties can also be inherited from the CAD model to save the designer time. Best-in-class auto meshing technology means that the designer can quickly generate a mesh with minimal effort. Here the designer chooses automatic element size option and accepts all default settings. NX then quickly meshes the part. Loads and constraints are defined directly on the geometry so the designer does not have to deal directly with the mesh elements or nodes. First, the designer defines fixed constraints on the geometry where this plastic cover connects to another structure. Next, the designer defines a pressure load to some of the faces of the part. Once done, the designer solves the part. After a quick solve, the designer has immediate feedback on performance. The designer also applies a post-processing template to the results view to get a consistent view of the results based on a predetermined criteria. A review of the results show that the peak deflection is about 0.75 mm, which is over the 0.6 mm requirement. So the designer decides to modify the design. The designer determines that moving the internal bosses and rib away from the back wall will add stiffness to the structure. Without leaving the NX environment, the designer is able to quickly make this change in seconds by simply selecting a face and dragging the geometry directly with synchronous technology. To analyze this new alternative, the designer goes back to simulation mode in NX and sees that the analysis model needs to be updated to reflect the changed geometry. The designer accomplishes the update with just a single mouse click. Also, since load and constraints were previously defined on the geometry, the boundary conditions automatically update to the new analysis model. The designer then simply clones and renames the original solution parameters to ensure he runs the same analysis as last time, and then solves the new model. NX lets the designer quickly set up views to compare performance of the original design versus the redesigned model side by side. Then by applying the post-processing template to both results, the designer can easily compare how each design performs with regards to the requirements. In this case, the new design now only deforms by 0.4 millimeters, well below the maximum requirement. 